I enter the room. I check for the scene safety. There are no hazards. I will enter. I draw the curtains for patient privacy. My hands are visibly clean. I'm going to use alcohol hand gel. Okay, ample amount, palm to palm, palm to palm, palm over the dorsum, palm over the dorsum, fingers interlaced, fingers interlock, fingers interlock, tips of the um, thumb rotation, thumb rotation, tips of the fingers, tips of the fingers, wrist to elbow, wrist to elbow, and allow my hands to dry for 30 seconds. Hi, good morning. Good morning. My name is Saima and I will be your nurse looking after you today. May I know your full name, please? Shalin Edward. Shalin, Shalin Edward, what would you prefer to be called? Shalin. Shalin. Shalin, do you mind if I confirm your details with your ID band and okay. the links I have here? It's fine. Okay, please give me your full name again. Uh, Shalin Edward. And your date of birth? 14 September 1976. Okay, and your hospital number is 001001. Okay, Shalin, do you have any allergies? Yes, I'm allergic to latex. To latex. And what reaction do you get from latex? It gives me rashes. It gives you rashes. Okay, Shalin, we'll make sure that we don't give, you are not in contact with any latex products while you are here in the hospital. Is that okay? Okay. Okay, Shalin, I'm here to uh, get a urine sample from you, like uh, for the midstream urine, th your doctor has requested for it. Is that okay? That's okay. Is this the right time for you to go to the toilet? Yes. Okay, before I give you the container, just want to ask, are you comfortable at this time? Yes, I'm comfortable. Do you... Uh, do you uh, do you have any pain or something? Mm -hmm. No, I'm you okay? I'm okay. All right, Charlene, I'll just uh, go and I will just go and bring you the uh, container. Okay, just give me one second. I will just gel my hands. I'll take the container. It's wide mouth container. I'll go back to the patient. Hi, Charlene. So here's the container. Okay. We call it a mouth a wide mouth container. It's for your urine. So what? How you gonna do it? Do you know it? No, no, no. No, I'm gonna explain it to you. You need, uh, you need to go to the toilet. Okay. First of all, you need to wash your area. So make sure you use the non-detergent soap and water. Wash it thoroughly. Okay. So you part. How do you wash? Oh no. You will wash it. You part the labia. Okay. And then use soap and water. And then run the water thoroughly. Okay. Then you you pack dry. One 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 uh, uh, towel from each for each side from front front to back and from top to bottom. Okay, so you will just clean it first and then uh, part the labia. Hold the container with in your hand and then first 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 fifteen to twenty ml of your urine first stream of urine goes into the toilet. Okay, the middle one you need to con like uh, you will uh, col collect it in the container without interrupting the flow of urine. Okay. So we need at least like 10 to 20 ml in this container and the rest will, goes, will go in the toilet as well. So you pass the mixed, uh, first bit in the toilet, okay, and then collect the middle one without interrupting the flow of the urine and then the remainder unit, urine will go into the toilet again. You understand? Mm -hmm. Okay, after that you can wash your hands, okay, and then bring back me the sample. Is that alright? Okay. Is that clear? Yes. Okay, so here's the container. Thank you. Okay, I perform hand hygiene. Okay, my patient gave back me to the urine sample. Okay, I'll place the urine sample here. I clean my hands again. I wear my apron and my gloves. And uh, I need I need the reagent strips. It's uh, look dry and intact. And then the expiry is 2025. It's okay, I'm happy to use it. I, I, I need some hand towels. I'll place that here. I need my watch or my fob watch. I will place it here on the, on the trolley. And uh, I need I need a pair of gloves. Yeah, okay. So I'm ready to do the procedure. I'm wearing my gloves and apron. I will uh, take one strip. I will open it and then take one strip and then make sure that I, I close it tightly and put it back. Okay. And now I open the urine container. I make sure that I don't touch the edges of the container. Okay. I dip the strip into the urine for one second and I, I, I immerse the strip into the urine completely for one second. Okay. I make sure I run the edges through the container to avoid uh, to remove the excess urine and then i put my strip at the paper towel in horizontal position okay i will wait for 30 seconds so for 30 seconds the first one is glucose it's now 30 seconds i can read glucose it's uh, 3 plus then i will wait for 10 more seconds for ketones 10 second ketones it's 4 
the next one is at 45 seconds specific gravity it's 1.02 okay at 60 second it's blood it's 2 plus okay and the protein at 60 second is negative nitrate 60 second negative I will wait for one to two minutes one more minute to see the leukocytes okay leukocyte 2 plus okay so I will discard the strip in the orange clinical waste and then I will discard the I will make sure that I discard the urine in the sluice room I'll discard my paper towels and then I will remove my gloves and apron I document I will document my readings okay yeah so I have documented it I will remove the things whichever I have used I go back to my patient Hi, hi, uh, Shalen. Yeah, I'm back with your results. Mm. So you've got a little bit of infection in mm. your urine, and there is uh, two plus blood as well. Mm. So I will make sure that I inform the results to your doctor, and mm -hmm. then he will come back and make a will make a plan on it. Okay. Okay. Yeah, maybe he needs to prescribe you some antibiotics and. Uh, and maybe he will send the sample in the lab as well. Okay. okay. And meanwhile, you can drink plenty of water to avoid any UTI. Okay. Okay. And you don't retract infection. And do you have any questions for me? No, I'm okay. You're okay. Yeah. Do you need a change of position? No, or? no, no. I'm fine. You're fine. All yeah. right. Okay. Here is the call bell. In case you need me, you can just press the buzzer. Okay. I will document everything in your chart that I've taken the sample and what the readings were and I'm going to explain you to the doctor as well. Okay. 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 Thank you so much. So I will clean my trolley. I will prepare it and keep it ready for the next user. And I will take the urine sample to the sluice room. I'll discard it there and then everything is clean. I'm done with the procedure with my final hand hygiene. Yeah. Thank you.